What's up guys, my name is Taylor and welcome to episode 7 I believe of my Pokemon Black Randomizer Nuzlocke. In the last episode, I did the Team Plasma stuff before fighting the Cassilia City Gym and we got our Insect Badge and in this episode, I'm gonna do both of the rival battles, I'm gonna get some encounters and then off screen, I'm gonna grind through all of the trainer and then I also wanted to post another video today where I take on the next gym leader or maybe I'll keep the grinding in the episode I don't know I'm still deciding on it but anyways what I'm gonna do is do the rival battles and the encounters for sure but before we do that I just want to apologize that I didn't get a video up on Sunday and that's just because I was lazy sorry I was just tired exhausted and yeah I was just lazy but our team right now is Ruby Crystal Star, the Torko holding the experience chair with Ember, Smog, Fire, Spin, and Curse. Then we have Wisdom, the Venipede with the Scope Lens with Pursuit, Protect, Poison Tail, and Bug Bite. Then we have Jolt, the Manetric holding the Amulet Coin with Howl, Quirithox, Spark, and Odor Sleuth. Then we have Dust Bunny and Scout, kind of as death fodder because I don't really like using them. Their move, their level up move set is really garbage. So yeah, that's why. So let's just head over to the gate with the speed of lag. Sorry for the, the freezing right there. I just plugged in my charger. And it's kind of going to be more chill episode. Like kind of the one where I don't talk as much. And I kind of want to just talk about random stuff in this episode. Um, throughout the grinding if I choose to do it. All right, all right, Bianca. Hey, Taylor. You remember the promise you made on the cross transceiver, right? So let's get right to our battle. But before I do, before that, ah, uh, they said we can have a Pokemon battle in the game as long as we're careful not to break the electronic, the electric bulletin board. Jeez, I'm the new and improved version of me. It's gonna go great this time. Let's start up our Pokemon battle again. Okay. She should have four Pokemon. Yep. Beautiful eye. Perfect. Perfect. Not not a dragon type. Uh Ember. Stun spore. Really now? This video is gonna be pretty long already. I just wanna I just want to get through it, but why do you have to paralyze me? Remoraid, okay. Go out on the jolt. Because Remoraid has bubble beam, and I'm pretty sure Torkoal cannot take the bubble beam. Uh, Spark. That would kill. Oh, I'm pretty sure both. Is this a. Uh, I played so many randomizers off screen so I can't remember this is the one where she has an Alola Mola oh that's a Vibrava okay I can't remember this is the one where Bianca has an Alola Mola and Sharon has a Swoobat I'm pretty sure that's the case but okay Vibrava shouldn't have Dragon Rage but it has but it has um it has Sonic Boom I think Bug Bite is neutral. I don't think Ground Resist Bug, like Bug Resist Ground. Yeah, nice. Faint Attack. Okay, so it does have Sonic Boom. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Super Potion? Really? Really? Why are you doing this? Why are you doing this? Just die. Just go on with your life and die. Get out of here, Vibrava. Good. Alright. Critical hit. Thank you. Alright, and then, yeah, this is the one with the Lola Mola and the Swoobat. Okay. Uh, Spark. Oh, 
Holy shoot, don't do this. Why does why do battles have to be stally? Aqua Jet, I'm fine. Please don't use a super potion. Please don't use a super potion. Gosh! Dang it. Okay. Get out. Get out. Get out. Thank you. All right, get out. I'll never be a strong trainer like you or Chair or Iris, but you know, since we left Nevema Town, I met a lot of people, and I've been thinking about what I want to do in life. When you look at, when you look at it that way, Pokemon have given me a lot of new experiences. Having been Pokemon Solo was just really hard and I felt really unsure. Still, I gotta say I'm really glad I went. I've learned so much on this journey and I also learned that being with Pokemon is really really important. Okay, well I hope to see you again soon. Bye bye Taylor. Bye bye. Um heal you up. Double paralysis heal. No, double cherry berry. Nope. Alright, Torgo, you're gonna stay paralyzed for now. Alright, and let's get this item and hopefully not get the encounter. Castelia Cone, does this get rid of status? Castelia Cone. Uh, he has all status problems. Nice, that's just what I needed. Alright, don't encounter. Nice. Okay. Alright, let's do this, Sharon. Actually, save. There you go. Hey, Taylor. I've been waiting for you to get the insect badge, and now it's time to see which of us, which one of us is the stronger trainer. Okay, so he has Swoobat, and he also has four, three other Pokemon. Leader and male. Riku? No, Riku? Okay. Okay, Riku, just stay there. Okay, good. Spark. Uh, there is a screw that. Um, twenty two. If anything, it should have confusion, so it's not a big threat. Ninjas. Okay, that does nothing. Get out of here. Don't heal, please. Please don't heal him. Thank you. Hall. Okay. Nice.
The cross transceiver is ringing. Hello there, Taylor. Do you have a second? Professor Juniper, do you need something? I called Bianca too, but I guess she didn't hear the call. I wonder what she's up. I wonder what she's caught up in. Well, I suppose I'll just have to call her again later. Okay, I'll be waiting for you to in front of the gate to Nebasa City. Um, hello. Nebasa City's gate is straight down Route Four. All right. So. Uh, let's. I'm gonna give the experience share to Wisdom, so hopefully he evolves to the Whirlipede. Let's save. Alright, and let's go along this route and get our route for encounter, and hopefully I don't battle too many trainers. Okay, get this item. Prism scale, so I can evolve a Thebas. Ah, son of a gun. Alright. Jigglypuff. And you know what? I'm just gonna speed through these battles because, like, these are just random battles. Sorry about the speed up, but I'm just gonna do it to make it go by faster. Cause just kill that dies. Alright. Gosh, it's so fast with it. I love it. And actually, I should put wisdom in front so it gets a lot of experience. Okay, save. Okay, so we didn't get our encounter there good because I don't like getting my encounter over there. Yes! Alright. Okay, here's Professor Juniper. Hello, Taylor. Come here. Alisa called and was asking me all about electric Pokemon, and I thought about you guys. That's why I wanted to see you. Ta-da! Freebies for you. Here, Charon. You too, Taylor. Yes, we have Ultra Balls. Nice. If you see a Pokemon that you want to have join you, be sure to use a good type of Pokeball, because this could be the first and last time you see that Pokemon. I know it might seem strange for me to say this since I'm the one who asked you to complete the Pokedex, but please remember to enjoy your journey. Of course, I'm not saying you can't just neglect the Pokedex, but you know that. Now, if you'll please excuse me, I have to go meet Bianca. It seems the professor gave us the Pokedex for, as a reason to send us on a journey. At least that's what my mom told me. They wanted us to go out and see the world, so my mom, Bianca's mom, and your mom made a request to Professor Juniper. Taylor, what should we do now? I think i like to show the professor my thanks by going to Route 4 and catching some Pokemon I haven't yet caught. Okay, so we're gonna do the same thing too, but just wanna go up here to Nimbasa City because this old man is getting pelted by two Team Plasma Grants. Grants, we know you run the daycare. How do you know? How do we know? Because we're Team Plasma. We are taking Pokemon away from people. Since you work at the daycare, we figure you must have a lot of Pokemon. Hand them over. What kind of nonsense is this? Oh, strong looking trainer, please help me. If you're going to get in our way, we'll take your Pokemon too. Oh yeah, I forgot if I have a Litwick in the daycare or not. Hmm. Uh, two Pokemon. Chimeco. Okay, so this is the Pokemon that killed Dano. And also, I'm worried because if it has a psychic move, it could kill Wisdom, but I should be fine to just Bug Bite. Okay. It used Uproar. This should do an okay amount. Mm, pursuit. Okay, I still faster. I was scared of it being a speed tie. If I lost two Pokemon to Chimeco Uproar, then. Oh my gosh, I do it mad. Venoshock. Uh, you're a physical attacker, so I don't need Venoshock. Uh, no, I don't want. Keep old moves. Give up. Okay. 
Poliwag, uh, so it's the Joe. Man, Poliwag looks so cool. Like, it looks so detailed and like, the colors just make it pop in this game. Yes! Ah, Willipede! Ah, there it is! Oh man, I, I really want a Scolipede. Scolipede is one of my favorite Gen 5 Pokemon. This went downhill fast, so I think we better run. Let's head out at the amusement park. Thank you so much. Please take this. I took my graduate. It's a brand new bike. I'd always plan on running around in Boston City, but I never ended up riding it. Yes, we got the bike. I have a daycare around three. If you have any Pokemon you want me to raise, please drop them off. I just came to sight to you, but I got in a lot of trouble. So now with that, we can now leave two Pokemon in the daycare and not just one. Hey Taylor, yoo-hoo! The professor told me the boss to say he has a lot of things to see and do. The music park, big city, a small court, and the battle subway. I'm going to go to the Pokemon mu uh, musical. See you later. So that's something we have to do later. I might just do it off screen because all you have to do is go to the Pokemon musical and participate in the dress up stuff. But, let's save. And then, now, let's try to get all the encounters, because I'm I'm not sure how long I've been going on for, because I haven't been looking at the time. But, what we have to do is, we need someone with a cut to go into an area. Thank you. We need... We need some of the cut, and I believe that one of our deceased Pokemon has it. Or if not, then Machino has it. Uh, yeah, then Machino must have it. Okay, so... Let's see if I can buy Ultra Balls. I cannot. I can't buy Hyper Potions. I don't think I need Hyper Potions just yet, so I just save my money. And now, let's get on the bike. Save. Alright, so, uh, let me just make sure that I have a Pokemon with cut. I don't have. Who did I use to cut? Wait, who did I have to cut then in the last... to get into the dream yard then? I thought it was one of my dead Pokemon, but... Oh, I think I have Sunkern. Do I have a Sun... I think I have a Sunkern? Uh... Oh no, it was Sister. That's right. There you go. So... We need someone cut to get into an area where we can get an encounter. So that's why I need sister right now. And I guess I'm and I guess I'm just gonna cut this off short. And I'm just gonna get all the encounters and fight all the trainers off screen. And then yeah, the next episode, which will also be uh today, for today, will uh We'll fight the Nimbasa City Gym and then do more other stuff. Do other stuff after that. Okay, so our Route 23, I believe, encounter is a Camerupt.
Just a minute. She said, just a minute. Go for a few balls. Alabama. Bye-bye. Oh, that tackle is doing a lot of damage. Focus energy. Okay, there's the poison. That's what I wanted. And the reason why I'm keeping Torquil in, even though it has a super effective move against me, is because even if even if Torquil uh, dies to this camera up now, um, he, camera up is a pretty good replacement. It has fire and ground typing. It has stab on both of them, and it's a it's equal. It's almost as bulky as he is. Okay, let's do the gray ball. Bye, yeah. Bye, Gigi. See you later. See you later. All right, we got camera up the eruption Pokemon. Oh man, I love camera up so much. It it's one of my favorite um, generation three Pokemon. Uh, I like to call. Have you ever seen like the top like this uh the smoke sacks on top of factory? That's that's what camera reminds me of with its like lava humps. So factory. We'll check on him later, but there's actually an item here. Okay, let's see what else we could got on this route. We could have got Rock and Roller, so I'm pretty happy that we got Camera Up because Rock and Roller is a Pokemon that you can typically get in this game. So I'm glad. I'm glad. I want to use Pokemon that you t don't get in the game. So I'm okay. I want to use Pokemon that you don't normally get in the game, so that's why I'm happy. Another Revival Herb, which is useless because we cannot revive Pokemon because it's a Nuzlocke. Um, okay, so here we have to go. We have to go in here, which is the Lost Lauren Forest. And first encounter in the Lost Lauren Forest is the Trat, which we already have, which means it's a dupe, which means I can skip this encounter and I can get a new one. So that's what I'm gonna do. It's interesting because I don't really know what the Lost Lauren Forest is for. Like, it just seems like a random like thing that they made. I don't know, that's just me. But we have a Lombre. Interesting. Uh, the thing with Lombre is, I would like to use the Lombre or Nuzleaf, but if I don't have a Water Stone, then it'll never evolve. And I could probably get like a better Water Pokemon or even a better Grass type Pokemon. But I'll catch it just because Dupes Claws is really important in Nuzlocke, just in case you run, I run into a Lotad or a Lombre, another Lombre or a Ludicolo, like you just saw, I can just skip it and then try and get a new encounter. Okay, uh, then bang, great ball. Really? Really, you didn't shake once in the great ball? But the camera up got caught in the first great ball I right threw? One, two, three. There we go. Oh, okay. yeah. Lombre the Jolly Pokemon. 
and I'm gonna nickname Lomri Lily because the lily pad on its on its head. So Lily. All right. Now let's get out of here. What route is this so I don't forget? Route 16. Okay. Uh. So rock and it seems like only rock and rollers and camera ups are on this route. All right, let's run away. All right, don't go into as many trainers as possible. And now we have to backtrack a little bit because there is there are three encounters that we can get back at Route 4 and the Desert Place. So we have to backtrack here, go back into Route 4. Turn. Nice. So we have to backtrack here. So this is Route 4, so we can get a counter in there. But typically, I like to get my Route 4 encounter over here towards the Desert Resort. So... I'm going to... Oh, wait, is it here? This is this should be the Dig TM. Uh, you the Dig TM? There we go. Lava Plume. Which is fantastic because we have two fire types. We have, we have Factory and we have... Finally, a good TM. We have Factory and we have... Uh, you can't earn Lava Plume. Wait, how can these guys earn Lava Plume? Wait, what? Yes? No, that's the alarm. That was the timer. Timer. Um, okay, so maybe... Because originally that team is Dig. So maybe because they can learn Dig, that's why they can learn Lava Plume. Really interesting, but I hope, I hope that Camera at least can learn it. But we have another trainer, so I'm just going to speed this up. Because what I want to do is I want to get the encounter and don't really care about the trainer. Uh, so to get an encounter in this route, you have to step on this darker colored sand. And now our route for encounter is a Paris. I mean, Paris is the worst thing, but we already have Wisdom, who's a bug type. And P Parasect isn't the best Pokemon when it comes to stats or anything. So I'm going to just choose this Great Ball. I'm going to see if I can get it. Again, it would be good for dupes, but I mean, I don't want it on my team. Okay, we got it. We got Paris, so at least we have it for dupes in case it shows up again. Paris, the mushroom Pokemon. Mushrooms name Tochu Kaso grow on its back. They grow along with the host Paris. That's cool. I didn't know the mushrooms were named something. Maybe those are named for actual Japanese mushrooms or something. But uh, we're just going to name you Shrooms because you have the mushrooms. Shrooms. All right, and now we so we got our route for encounter. So now if I can dodge this guy, okay. So now here we have the desert resort, and thank goodness I got on my bike just in time. You got. I like to go further into the desert resort. Uh, be, uh, these guys should just say that the resort, right? Okay. So I have to go further into the desert resort past this gate if I can make it through. Yes. To get my encounter because there's a lot of trainers and encounter and it's a really wide area so i typically like to have it over here and i like to have it not there not there don't get the encounter i like to have it in this here it is this huge pile of sand okay so there we go our encounter for the desert resort is a sneasel Ooh. This is interesting because Sneasel is okay by itself, but if I have a Razor Claw, yeah, if I have a Razor Claw, it'll evolve into Weavile, which he is a monster. Weavile is a monster. So I still like Sneasel, so I'll still take it, but if I can get a Razor Claw, then Sneasel will evolve. 
Ah, oh, come on. Come on, can't tease me like that. You cannot tease me like that, Sneezo. Ah, come on. So there's Quick Attack Taunt, so its moves it isn't the best right now. But it hopefully gets like an Ice and Dart. It probably will get Faint Attack. Hopefully it gets a good Ice type move. Oh, come on. This Quick Attack's doing 6. This answer is doing 4. So every turn I take 10 damage at the minimum. Minimum 10 damage, so I should be fine. 1. Okay, I'm gonna switch out right now so I don't die to the Sneasel. Uh, switch in Torgol. And then... One. Ah, oh, come on. Quick attack. Quick attack does five. The sandstorm does four, so I take nine damage each turn. I'm still gonna go great ball. I don't want to use ultra balls because I can't buy ultra balls yet. One, two, three. Oh, come Oh, this thing looks like you know this quick attack at time. Come on, just get caught. One. Oh my goodness. Come on, get caught, Sneasel. One, two, three. There we go. All right, we got Sneezo, the Sharp Claw Pokemon. All right, and I'm gonna name Sneezo. I'm gonna name it Nekochan because it's a cat, and it kind of and it's kind of cute. So, and if those of you don't know, uh. Neko is cat in Japanese if anyone didn't know. So Neko chan. Yeah. I see no putting the hyphen in it, but it's fine. Okay, so we have that and so the final encounter that we have to do is in the Relic Castle. Wow, I went a long time without I went a long time without um Without encountering something, that was cool. Uh, no. I want to use all the potions first. Nope. Potion. I'm just healing up because you have to go through some trainers over here before you get to the... Uh, before you get to the fossil, which I want to get inside the Relic Castle. In addition to the encounter. So, here we go. Relic Castle. Okay, so our Relic Castle encounter is... A Numo, and we have Camera, which means it's a species clause. Which is, if you have someone in the evolution line of a Pokemon, you can skip the encounter and you can try and encounter again. So that's what I'm doing. I'm gonna do species clause right there. I'm just gonna walk around the trainers. Okay, so Relic Castle encounter is a Shelmet, which I cannot evolve. So again, this is a Pokemon where I don't want it, and I'm just capturing for dupes. Which sucks. But. Oh man, it's. Oh wait, I made. Wait, wait. I think I made um, impossible evolutions possible, so I don't need to trade to evolve it. I think I just have to get it to like level 40 or something. I don't know, I never tried it before, but if 
If Wisdom ever dies, I'm putting this guy on the team, and I'm gonna call this... Uh... I'm gonna call this Helmet Bro. I don't know why, but... I remember watching something, or... I like saw something with Helmet Bro in it. I don't know, I don't know. That's just what it reminds me of. Okay, and then here, this girl gives you a fossil. So we're gonna take cover fossil because I like Tortuga more than Archon in the real game. So yeah, so that's gonna be the end of the video. I'm gonna say it right there. And then off screen, I'm gonna go through all these trainers. I'm gonna level up my team. And then the next episode, which will also be posted today, uh, I'm gonna challenge the gym and then we'll do some other stuff after that. But with that being said, thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Until next time, goodbye.